beauties and welcome back. So today's video is going to be how I do my makeup for a day to day. This is the look that I go to when I have to go to class, when I have to run errands. And it's a very quick and easy look to create. It literally takes me like about 10-15 minutes. But yeah, if you guys want to see how I created this look, just keep watching. First, we're going to go in with our Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. I love to use this because it's so hydrating on the face. I have very dry skin, and when I put this on, I feel like my face, my face, my face is so hydrated throughout the day. I don't really know if, I don't really think that it helps with keeping the makeup on a lot longer, but I do know that when I have this on, my face just feels so fresh and moisturized. So, yeah. For foundation, because this is a I'm going to class look, I love to use the Maybelline Fit Me Stick Foundation. This foundation, I feel I had it in my makeup collection for a while and I never tried it until like the day before class. And I was like, whoa, this foundation is so lightweight. Like, I literally feel like I have nothing on my face when I wear this. I like to put some on my forehead, down on my face. On my nose, my neck. And this is so smooth and so natural. It looks so natural on my skin. I didn't realize. I like to go in with a dense brush to put this on because when I feel like I put it on, since it's so lightweight, when I put it on with my beauty blender, I feel like it takes a lot of product off and I don't really see. It doesn't really look like I have any foundation on my face. So I like to go in with this because this usually like pushes it into the skin or also spreads it around instead of taking so much product like the beauty blender does. So blend that evenly onto the face. fit me in the color 25 I love this concealer for a day to day because it's not as thickening it's very creamy and it blends out so seamlessly I think it's such a good concealer for a day to day and this is the one that I technically is my go to sometimes I like to switch back and forth with the NYX HD I think it's the NYX HD I'm not sure But because this is a on my way to class makeup, I like to go in with products that I don't feel like it caking up my face or I don't feel like, you know, I feel like I have too much because who really wants to feel like they have too much makeup on at 8 in the morning? To blend on my concealer, I like to go in with my Morphe G2 brush. bronze on my face I'm gonna go in with Hula from Benefit Cosmetics and I'm going to be using my buffing brush from Real Techniques. On a day-to-day -day, I like to use this to you know carve out my cheekbones instead of going in with my contour kit because I feel like this is much quicker. translucent powder
I also like to apply, set this on my, but I like to just use a little bit. It's all gone. And apply that to set my foundation. For blush, I'm gonna go in with my NYX Cosmetics in the color Amber. This blush is so beautiful. It's such a beautiful neutral blush. I don't know if the camera can pick that up, but it's so beautiful and it's so creamy. I don't think a lot of people a lot of people underestimate NYX blushes, and I think they're just so good. I'm gonna go in with my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Champagne. And this highlight is so beautiful. Next, I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Tip Brow Pomade in dark brown to fill in my brows. For eyes, I like to keep it very, very simple. I like to add a very neutral-ish transition color into my crease just to give it a little bit of dimension but I don't really like to apply a lot of shadow on my eyes so I like to go in with Wanderer from the Tarte Cosmetics Tartlet Palette and I like to apply Wanderer right over my crease and that's all that I do for my eyes just to add a little bit of dimension and reapply that crease. Carbon Black by L'Oreal. This is a, a drugstore mascara, but it's also my favorite mascara. I don't use any other mascara but this one. It is the best. I don't really like to apply false lashes for a day-to-day -day look. For lips, I like to go in with a very nude color, and this is my favorite matte liquid lipstick ever. I think that the formula in Colored Rain's liquid lipsticks are the bomb. They're awesome. This is the color Sugar by Colored Rain. Makeup with the Mario Badescu skin skincare. After you set your makeup, this look is complete. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. See you guys next time.